What up, Jaden? Imagine yourself in a box, dark, empty, small box. Your thoughts and ideas can go nowhere except the place that you're trapped in. Your thoughts, anger, monsters you create escape to nowhere. In that same box, terrible moments, negative comments, or pain you experience in your life come up in the same area. The irony is for some people, that box is their brain. The mind has unlimited space to retain as much information as possible. Wouldn't it be a shame if someone's mind is damaged by other people's sinister doings? No matter what is said to or about me, I try to be as positive as possible. I get called a lot of things like Turtle Man, Key and Peel, Man's Like Nausea. I'm always told that I'm one of those people who make others laugh without having to do anything. That's something money can't buy. Anyway, a little bit about myself. I'm from Upper Marlboro, Maryland. I had a perfect life. Still have a lot of true friends, real friends. Those real friends motivate me a lot. Friendship and brotherhood is pretty serious where I'm from. Simple rules. Stick together, don't waste each other's time. I made a promise to my close friends back at home and even to myself that I would be successful in anything that I do. I was homeschooled before eighth grade. In middle school, I was one of two black boys out of eight black students in a private school. Alonzo, the other black kid, is like my blood brother. Taylor is one of the black girls. It's like my blood sister. There are more names, but those two motivate and keep me thinking positive all the time. Now my goals. I want to be a music producer. I have my own YouTube page that is growing slowly, and my name is getting around as well. Music to me and others that are similar is like a story. Music can speak to you. The tone, the rhythm, the melody, it's always a story. I could easily sit down and get lost with making multiple beats, jumping around in my room, vibing, thinking good thoughts. It can change lives. Drake, J. Cole, Bryson Tiller has made most people cry at night. Music touches people no matter what mood you're in. Something that has changed over the years, lyrics. Lyrics matter. There are millions of songs, plenty of artists, and it only takes a few words for someone to remember you by. Just in general, words are like toothpaste. Once it comes out of the tube, it's impossible to put it back in. Like hate. Hate is permanent. It's an incurable cancer that can be forgotten but never removed. Why is this important? Growing up daily, I was always reminded that I looked different from the other kids I played with. Now for me, the gym is like a gateway drug. Being a chubby kid scarred me for life. And other people don't realize that unless they're dealing with the same struggle. Before I end, the ones who feel alone, suicide is not the option. People call you weak-minded because they don't know anything that's going on in our heads. And when you explain to those same people what's going on in our thoughts, they'll laugh. Then they'll tell you to your face that you're the one exaggerating. They aren't going to listen. For those who feel alone, you don't need they. It's your life. It's too short to worry about they. You have to do whatever makes you happy, not they. You only know what's best for you. I go by Nasha the Trillis. I hope you remember my name. Thank you.